Hey guys, it is Buster72, and welcome back to another video on the channel. So today we are in the brand new islands. Uh, probably gonna call it brand new because they they they, they decided they were gonna restart everybody. So pretty much everybody got restarted. Um, not fully restarted, but almost fully restarted. I used to have 500,000 uh, coins. Where am I now? I'm about 175,000. So it took away about 400,000 or so coins from me. I know other people lost way more than that. Uh, what else did they do? They removed the banker from spawn. Um, they also took away a lot of inventory stuff. So for example, you guys remember, I used to have a million coal. All right, all right, 999,999 if you want to be super exact. But they brought me down to a bit below nine grand. I clicked, I, I collected a few more. But they took away a whole bunch of my coal. Uh, a bunch of my copper ingots um practically they thought if you duped items into the game then they practically just took the items away from you which i did not dupe any gold I actually yeah i didn't dupe any items into the game all these all items that are in my inventory unless given by me any of the items that i earned i did not dupe into the game so i'm a bit mad at islands because i used to have a whole bunch of copper ingots um they took a bunch of those away and also i had a, i had over three thousand gold because i was I have kid on my island, and then would just collect the uh, drill, the gold drills, and I think I'm lagging out because everyone is just moving in place. That's not good. All right. Anyways, enough of me being mad at islands. Um, I mean, I guess it was somewhat necessary, but I think there was a better way to do it. I don't know. But anyways, they added new skills. So welcome. To... All right, my recording cut for some reason, but I'm, I was gonna say welcome to RuneScape. Because practically, you got to earn skill levels. So there's farming, there's woodcutting, pickaxe, economy, combat, light melee, heavy melee, archery, magic, cooking, animal husbandry, fishing, and foraging. You didn't catch all that? Uh, sorry about that. I'll have all the new skills listed out in the comments below. But practically, they're kind of self-explanatory. <laughs> I'm not going to go through each and every one. But from what I've seen, um, so you need forging in order to sell a gearbox to this dude. You need animal husbandry in order to buy stuff from her. Here, I'll show you. So you need animal, animal husbandry levels. You don't need anything for him. You don't need anything new for him. For seeds, you need farming. For this dude, you need farming. For this dude, you actually don't need anything. Uh, for him, you also need farming and some mining here and there. And for adventurer, you need combat. Which, what's the difference between combat, light melee, and heavy melee? And then there's probably going to be some NPCs on the different islands, especially like the desert island where he's going to have you do other kinds. You need other kinds of skills. But anyways, the max level you can get is level 99. Um, so have fun getting that. I think maxing out that is going to be kind of cool. Or like the new thing everyone's trying to do. Oh, would you look at that? They added new icons to the side. Oh, okay, so you can see all your... Okay, that's sick. I, I didn't even know that. You click this uh, icon here, and it shows you all your skill levels. Um... Yeah, so you can see I'm all level 1. I haven't started on anything yet. I just thought I'd start recording um, to get you guys a video out as soon as possible. Hey, it's Mr. Eggs right there. Okay, how do I get... Oh my gosh. Okay, so ever since the update, everything has been super duper slow. Um, no joke, it took me at least 20 minutes to load into the spawn island. That's legitimately how long it took. So I'm expecting it to take also a long time to load back in. So while it's loading, I'm going to explain the other things they added. So they added a sheep. They added animal spawn eggs that you can purchase from Talia. I, I guess that's how you pronounce her name. They added animal breeding, so they can at breed animals. And of course, they added baby animals, because that just makes sense. I'm going to pet my cat. Oh! Oh! Should look at that. So I got animal husbandry just for petting him. So if I use a milk bucket... I can't milk them. Maybe that's the male one. Uh, and some of you are going to say you can still milk it. Shut up. Uh, what? Oh, was that me trying to milk him? So I need animal husbandry level 3 in order to milk him. I think. <laughs> Alright, whatever. Yeah, okay. Um, that's that. Okay, uh, added... So it does tell you if you get stuff. So if I... Mine... Okay, I got that. I got that. Are you kidding? I can't use a gilded steel pickaxe? Wow. 
Okay. I can't even use an iron pickaxe? Oh my gosh. That this is actually this is actually like really bad. So I have to start off with a copper pickaxe and work my way up. Are you kidding me? That's gonna so much grinding involved. Oh my gosh. Okay. I'm mad. Um Alright. You're not here to you're not here to hear me rant. Uh let's see what else they did. Animal. Each animal has unique personalities and traits. Yep, I got that idea. With the book thingy they added. Um Sell animals. So you can sell animals. Awesome. Upgrade an max animals. Okay, so you can upgrade your animals. Cool. New happiness algorithm. I'm assuming that's for animals. Can I, can I milk this kid? Alright, I call everything kid. I'm sorry. I cannot milk the cow. Alright. Yeah, I got it. I can't use it. Very cool. Animals now blink and sometimes look at you. Yeah, he was just looking at me. Yep, he looks at me. Redesigned the animal inspection menu. All right, they added shears, added cloth, an auto milker. An auto milker? Oh, so we're going to put these guys into slavery now. Like they do at all the dairy farms. A uh, sheep scratcher. So you can... Okay, cool. And a wool vacuum. So in other words, if you want to automatically vacuum your sheep. Now, where on earth is my sheep? Watch as he spawn somewhere up there. I'd be mad. I'd be really mad. You know, I could probably just push him off because I don't think they take damage. Um, I'm just going to explain the rest of the update because I'm still mad about the fact that I can't use my gilded pickaxe. Uh, they added wool blocks plus colored blocks. Added a spinach crop, so you're going to have to buy that. And that's apparently good for animals. They added tree health to make axes and woodcutting stats more useful. Changed sapling growth to make it harder to AFK slash macro. Um, okay, I never AFK'd saplings. <clears throat> Improved block break particles. All right, removed island keys. So you don't have to use island keys anymore, even though you can still have them if I can find it. I have island keys. I swear I have island keys. Do I not have island keys? Yeah, there we are. Island keys. Um, removed coin bags and the banker. As you can see, it spawned. He wasn't there. I'm not going to go back there because it takes forever to load in. Fix crops instantly growing after rejoining the game. Okay, that is some glitch I did not know about. They got rid of the M thing. That was super annoying. Um, and beyond that, uh, they messed up their game. So yeah, I'm going to be grinding out uh, level 99 on practically everything. But uh, with that being said, yeah, that's just the new update in Roblox Islands. I think they wanted to rebalance everything, um, give everyone something to do. And again, it's like RuneScape. You have to get your levels back. But anyways, guys, that's just video on the new update in Roblox Islands. Hope you guys enjoyed, and I'll see you all next time.